Hi Taurus, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody is doing fantastic. Getting ready here to do your July tarot reading. We're going to see what comes through here for the month of July. We're going to pull some oracle messages, general oracle messages. We'll pull some tarot. We'll get specific messages for love. A few specific messages for money career and then we'll see what you don't see coming for the month of July so with that let's get started let's see what comes through here for Taurus for July okay oh watching hmm now this could tell me two things it could tell me somebody's watching you okay but this could also tell me that you're gonna be very intuitive during the month of July. This could tell me you're gonna be also looking out for you. And it's an energy where uh, seeing is believing, okay? So it's almost like you are going to be more aware or have an awareness of what's going on around you, okay? And it's something too about truth. Some of you are, are looking, it maybe you're looking for some sort of truth or clarity about a situation in July. But just could tell me you're just very aware. You've got a, a heightened sense of awareness in the month of July. Let's see what else comes through. Okay, you got financial constraints and you have magician in the mirror. Okay, that tells me, Taurus, I feel like you're going to be very money conscious, very money conscious, uh, conscious in the month of July. Okay, so some of you, it may be that you're not spending as much. It could be uh, guidance here, you know, uh, conserve your money. But the magician also tells me that you're going to be able to make things happen. I may pull another card there too. Oh my gosh, look at that. Expect a miracle. Have faith that your prayers have been heard and are answered. This is Mother Mary. Okay. If there's something about your money financial situation, they're telling you things are going to change. Okay. So a lot of you, I'm just going to say, uh, showing me there's some sort of emphasis on money for the month of uh, July. It tells me too that something can change in your financial situation with that miracle card as well. Okay, that's what's manifesting with the magician. If you, you know, you feel the cupboards are bare here, uh, it can also talk about love. Okay, so some of you, it may be, maybe you're not seeing a whole lot change in your love life. Maybe you're feeling like there's lack of movement or change in your love life. Again, there's that Expect the Miracle card. So let's see what comes through with the tarot. Oh my gosh, the tower. Capricorn got that as the first card. So you have the tower. Let's see what else comes through here for Taurus. Six of Pentacles. I love it. Look at that. King of Pentacles, too, on the bottom of the deck. Something unexpected is going to happen, okay? So if you are feeling some sort of financial constraint, you're going to get some sort of unexpected money, okay? Or something comes in as a result of your hard work. Now, this could also tell me somebody is going to reach out to you or it can be also someone is going to... Uh, help you or assist you let's keep going okay there's that king of pentacles yeah knight of swords and king of pentacles okay some sort of movement is happening here now some of you with this king of pentacles could also be an offer communication you may get some unexpected news or communication some of you it's it's money related some of you it's around love let's keep going what else comes through here some of you could be an Aquarius Libra Gemini or another earth sign Capricorn Taurus Virgo three of Pentacles nine of cups ten of wands okay oh my gosh look at this eight of Pentacles this is the end of I feel maybe some sort of heavy energy or burden that you have been feeling where you feel there's some sort of lack. A lot, I'm going to say for a lot of you, it could be money, 
but it can be around relationships as well. You have the tower here and you have the three of pentacles, okay? Something very unexpected is going to happen, all right? So I almost feel with that watching card, okay, maybe you've, you have felt disappointed around a situation, but I feel like you're going to, you're going to see it, okay? It's going to happen. It's going to happen here, okay? This tells me with the tower, it could be in the blink of an eye that there's some sort of change that happens and you get that clarity, okay? Three of Pentacles, something's, something's coming together. Something's about to work out for you. Now, you have uh, the Six of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups. See, this could be the wish. Something's coming towards you. And I feel for a lot of you, it's financial. And it's bringing you a lot of happiness, like feeling content. So if you're feeling like the money isn't coming in or money is lacking or you had a lot of expenses uh, in the past... Some of you, it could be maybe you're trying to get a loan for something. That assistance is coming in. See, here's where the energy changes. Knight of Swords, this is what's manifesting. The Magician, Knight of Swords, and the Ten of Wands. I feel like there's some sort of communication or news that comes in for you. And it takes a load off of your back here, I feel, with this Ten of Wands. Very nice energy. Or you get the help that you need. Okay, people coming together, working together. You have the King of Pentacles and you also have the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, some of you too, you own your own business because could tell me more work is coming in for you. Some of you, you know, if you, you don't, you're not working, this could definitely tell me an offer is coming in. This could also be somebody that you see some effort in a relationship. Maybe you, there's someone you haven't seen a whole lot of effort, right? You Maybe you feel like you're carrying the load here. Okay, now bottom of the deck here, you do have the Five of Swords, you have the High Priestess, you also have here the Hermit, Strong Virgo, Cancerian, and Pisces, okay? So there definitely feels like there's some sort of situation you've been very conflicted about, but it's telling me you're going to gain the intuitive insights, okay? Remember I said you're going to have a more heightened awareness, the Hermit card also tells me that you're going to find those answers within. Your intuition is really going to guide you here. The Emperor, look at that. The Emperor and the Ten of Pentacles. This is upcoming energy. So, oh my gosh, look at this. Emperor and the Empress. This could tell me there's a relationship that's upcoming here that's going to work out, leading to something long-lasting. But it, for some of you, like I said, this could be around a business or a, uh, an employer where there's some offer and it brings in more money and work is the energy I'm picking up. So I'm going to pull specific messages in love, but first I'm going to pull a few uh, in regards to money and career. What can you share with Taurus around money and career? Love it. Very nice card here. Okay. Wow. Wow. Beautiful energy. Look at this. You got the four leaf clover. You have the good luck card. It says here, your fortune is improving and you will get a lucky break soon. Collect nuggets of wisdom. You will need them in the near future. Okay. So your past experience has brought you to where you are now. So there's something about that. Uh, it may be around decision making, but it's really that lucky break. And again, expect a miracle. You also have here courage. Ask what you are afraid of so you can overcome what's holding you back now. There are leadership opportunities for the taking. Okay, so that could be an indication that there is possibility for you to level up in your career. If reflection, take time to revisit the past and figure out what you don't want to do knowing what you don't like will show you what you truly love so again there's something here about burdens it could be taking on too much of a workload or responsibility or maybe just seeing you know you're you know not seeing your money increase okay so that's uh definitely 
a very specific message there for you of success. The path you are on will bring you success and prosperity if you just keep jo do I'm sorry, just keep going. Lots of little steps take you a long way. You're on track. Yeah, see, look at that right there with the King of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, the Eight of Pentacles can talk about your focus. So don't lose your focus, whatever you're trying to achieve here in money and career, okay? Now, let's get to your specific love messages, and then we'll see what you don't see coming. What else can you share with Taurus regarding love? What's coming in for love for Taurus? Okay, so you have uh, children, okay, maybe some of you have children, but this talks really about innocence and fun, so it feels like a newness, some sort of newness in your love life is going to happen, you know, where you, it's, I feel like the honeymoon phase, or it is the honeymoon phase, the first few months, you have uh, darker hair, this is a very focused, intense energy, uh, someone here could have uh, dark hair, or darker features career okay this could be somebody um, picking up somebody here who is very successful very business oriented I get someone who could be older than you mature energy now I said this already darker features it's not about male or female it's about the energy Hmm, interesting. We have the gossip card here. I want to see what else comes through. Okay, you got the beauty queen. Okay, again, not about male or female, it's about the energy. Okay. Someone who's coming in for you. Now, they could do something where they're in, you know, they get a lot of attention. Uh, it's definitely adoration energy so it could tell me this person's going to give you a lot of attention and maybe people are going to talk when they see you together now this could be somebody that you know um through the grapevine maybe even uh in your neighborhood okay could be your neighbors gossiping here something here about gossiping Okay, yeah, dating. So you're going to be dating someone or seeing somebody and people are going to be talking about it for whatever reason. Now, if it's somebody, you know, I'm getting this career card. Some of you it could be within the workplace. So be cautious because uh, it could be the workplace gossip for some of you, not all of you. But I see dating, whining, dining as well. Um, could also be a redhead. I get redhead or darker hair. And uh, somebody who dresses fashionable, trendy, and uh, really into music. And we got karma opportunities. Okay, so it doesn't mean that, you know, it's a karmic, but uh, definitely opportunities here with this person. But they are mature. Could be a little bit older than you. Um, could even have salt and pepper hair. So let's see what you don't see coming. So I feel like if money, if you feel, you know, money or love has been lacking, I see definitely changes. So you're going to see the result here. Now the watching, you know, that watching car could be people watching you. Oh my gosh. Or it could even be a specific person who's interested. But what is it that Taurus doesn't see coming for July? Let's get one more. Yeah, something new is happening. Okay, we're going to start with here. Page of Cups. Some sort of new beginning. Oh my gosh, look at this. Some of you, this is new love, or there's some sort of new exciting offer coming towards you that is perfect for you. Okay, that's that Two of Cups energy. So it could be a perfect relationship. It could be a perfect offer you know, as it relates to money career, but there's something new and exciting with this page of cups. Now, I feel, remember we have the tower here. 
something is is coming to a close now i feel um you know you may have been feeling some sort of disappointment in your situation whatever you've been dealing with that's where the lack energy comes through but like i said something's manifesting it says expect a miracle i feel what's happening here you got the hangman you have the ten of swords and you have the tower what's unexpected you don't see coming now, this is the end of delays this is the end of lack here. Beautiful energy is what I'm picking up here for you, Taurus. And oh, and I, I didn't even, uh, read this card. They have the world card. This is my success around the corner, feeling on top of the world. New beginnings, new chapters in your life. So beautiful, beautiful energy. Some of you, it's a new relationship on the horizon as well. So Taurus, I hope you enjoyed your reading. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening. And I'm sending you angel love.